So we're here at Kay Woods Game Lodge in the Northwest Territory of South Africa, and we're hunting ducks. I've hunted ducks here before with Bob and Alex, who have created what can only be described as a wing shooting paradise. So many different species of uh, birds to shoot, pigeons, doves, guinea fowl, Franklin, sand grouse, geese, and all manner of different ducks. They really are spoilt for choice. Now, Bob and Alex, they're English, and they have brought all of their experience and knowledge for wing shooting in the UK over here to South Africa, and they have done an incredible job. So although the types of species that we're shooting is very different, the actual style of shooting is very familiar. So we're shooting ducks in a local pond, not too far from, from the lodge here. And it was kind of a dry um, river fed pond, which means there were very small pools of water, but clearly a lot of duck on there. We've been down in the morning and as we arrived to have a look, about two or three hundred ducks all lifted up at the same time. The sky was black with animals. And as we moved on to the next section of the pond, another two or three hundred ducks went up in the air. So we knew there was plenty of animals there. We got quickly into position, um, hoping that not only the ones that had gone off would soon come back, but also waiting for the ones that we'd seen in the morning. Um, we set out, uh, Bob had set out the hides in three different areas, one for myself, one for Matt, and then one for Javier. And with the way that the wind was blowing and the bank behind us, it was very clear that the birds would come in from my left, sweep past me, then Matt, and then Javier, giving us all a really good chance of taking our birds. It started a little bit slow, um, probably coming in ones, twos, and threes. Oh, beauty. And after we'd been there for about an hour and a half, maybe two hours, then large flocks started to come in. 20 or 30 at a time, all spinning around, going past the stands, past the hides. Everybody getting a chance to get a shot off, whether or not we connected or not, was another matter. But then they break out behind us, and you could never really see where they were coming from. Coming from the left, coming from the right, or straight over the top. So it, it really did make for exciting shooting. Did I hear you? Beautiful. The evening's not quite finished yet, but it's getting close. Uh, we've had some fantastic shooting, not the two or three hundred birds. As you can hear behind me, the, the sky's getting very angry. Not the two hundred, three hundred birds that we saw earlier on, but certainly there's been a lot of animals, a lot of birds coming into the, uh, into the ponds. And then here's a couple more. It's been an incredible evening. Um, I think we've all shot our quota for tonight, which is fantastic. Um, bit of picking up to do. I've got wet trousers and they're still coming in now. So I think after that last one, that's my 10. And uh, now I've got a bit of cleaning up to do. Yeah, all in all, a fa fantastic, action-packed day's duck shooting and another wonderful evening and a sunset that only South Africa can provide. <laughs>